Hello my lords and welcome to the Beyond Standards channel. My name is Shanks and today I'm going to show you how to zoom out in Battle for Middle Earth 1 without any limitations. But before we're gonna jump into the video, I would like to remind you that you are also able to catch us on the Twitch TV slash Beyond Standards live stream, which is by the way exclusively based on BFME games. Link is gonna be in the description down below and I would love to meet you also in the upcoming stream. Anyways, uh, there is gonna be an invite link to the Discord which you need in order to download the file to zoom out in BFME 1. It's gonna lead you to the Maps channel and you, all you need to do is left click on Remove Zoom Limit. It's gonna start the download automatically. It's a RAR file. In order to extract RAR files guys, you will need um, something like WinRAR. We have it on desktop now, we're gonna cut it out from desktop. Click on one of the folders, go on Programs, Username, Your Name, App Data, Roaming, and then My Battle for Middle Earth files. Here we need to find the folder Maps, and now we're gonna place this uh, Remove Zoom Limit into this one, okay? Just like that. Now we need to just extract this one, right click on it, and extract here. And we are pretty much almost done. Now we have to start Battle for Middle Earth game. It's gonna ask for permission, that's why you have a black screen now. And as the game starts, we need to do one more thing to make it work. And by the way, I know this question is gonna come. Yes, you are also able to use that in multiplayer and no, your opponent or your ally doesn't have to use it. It's gonna still work perfectly fine. Gonna go on solo play and select skirmish. And actually, it's gonna be like this in your case and you will need to left click on official maps and find player made maps which is gonna lead you to this one. Just start the game now. It's gonna start and end the game automatically. Continue. Now we can switch to the official maps one more time. Select for example the map for Horizon, just why not. And now you will get to see how the zoom out is looking like. <laughs> That's gonna be amazing, trust me on that one. All right, this is how the zoom out is normally looking like, right? So pretty zoomed in, you can even zoom in more. This is how it normally looks like, but when you actually scroll back, you can see now we are able to zoom out really, 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 really far. And it's gonna work in skirmish, it's gonna work in multiplayer, and this way you will get to see much more of, much more actually. And you, I don't, I don't recommend you guys to zoom really far because this way you don't get to see many, many units and details. But you can play like this, and it's gonna be perfectly fine. You will see the entire map or entire base. Yeah, you will see a lot of stuff happening before they reach your side of the map. And again, it's gonna work on every single map. Just to prove you guys, we're gonna select now one more map. That's for example, select Rohan, just why not? Anyways. And also gonna work, of course, with every single faction. But one thing you need to make sure, you need to be sure about is the zoom out, as you can see. Uh, we can zoom pretty much like that, just like that. When you zoom too, too far away, it's gonna start lagging a little bit, so I would not recommend you guys to zoom more than that. But I think that's already a big improvement. One thing you need to do every time you start Battle for Middle Earth 1, you have to first of all go, also in multiplayer it's possible. For example, you are playing multiplayer via Game Ranger. You go on multiplayer, click on Network. And you always want to create a game and select this one first, start the game. Uh, always, because otherwise it's not gonna work. So you need, you need to do that always when you start BFME for the first time. And again, it's gonna start the game. And it's gonna end the game right after. That's gonna take you literally 5 seconds. And then you're gonna create the game. It's gonna work on mul multiplayer, it's gonna work on skirmish, it's gonna work everywhere. Even if your opponent doesn't use it, even if your ally doesn't use it. I hope this video was helpful guys and hopefully this was helpful for everyone who was asking the question, Shanks, how you zoom out that much? Now you know you know how, and that is also possible in BFME 2 in Rise of the Witch King. If you would like me to make a video about that one, let me know in the comment section down below. If this video was helpful, please don't forget to leave a like, and also share it with your friends, who also want to be able to, you know, zoom out a little bit more. Thank you guys for watching, i see you next time, until then, take care of yourselves, and as always, stay beyond standards. Peace guys.